The BioACL technique enhances ACL reconstruction by integrating next-generation orthobiologics to improve functional outcomes and reduce tunnel widening. Begin by performing a bone marrow aspiration from the proximal tibia, which will be processed using the ANGEL system. The ANGEL system uses proprietary three-sensor technology to develop a customized, patient-specific formulation of CPRP from BMA. Prepare for autographed bone collection by connecting the GraphNet device to suction and an arthroscopic shaver. Identify the desired femoral tunnel location and advance the flip cutter 3 reamer. Introduce the arthroscopic shaver with the GraphNet tissue collector attached into the joint and ream the femoral socket while collecting bone debris. The autologous bone debris will be collected in the GraphNet's sterile chamber. This autologous tissue is highly viable, demonstrating osteogenic significant capacity. Transfer the collected autogenous bone to a sterile dish and add 5 cc of AlloSync Pure Demineralized Bone Matrix. Titrate 3 cc of CPRP from BMA, prepared with the ANGEL system, into the dish. The bio-ACL composite mixture is complete and ready for delivery. On the back table, prepare the quadlink ACL graft. Elongate the femoral tightrope to ensure the quadlink ACL graft sits outside the joint after passing the femoral tightrope button. This positioning allows clear visualization of tunnel fill. The tightrope 2 implant is preloaded with fiber tape suture for the internal brace technique. Begin ACL graft passage by pulling in the femoral tightrope button through the socket and flipping onto the cortex. With the elongated femoral tightrope, the quadlink ACL graft should be sitting outside the joint. From the medial portal, insert the delivery cannula preloaded with the bio ACL composite and completely fill the femoral tunnel. Then, move to the lateral portal and deliver the composite into the tibial tunnel. The bio ACL composite graft compresses around the quadlink ACL graft. Fully filling both tunnels with this composite has demonstrated a reduction in tunnel widening post reconstruction. Fully seat the quadlink ACL graft into both femoral and tibial tunnels. Complete internal brace final fixation in full extension. After cycling the knee several times, complete femoral and tibial tightrope final tensioning. 